Oops. So I've got two out of the three machines working. I'm waiting for a capstan belt for that one. Because it's so loose that when I press play, it just stops by itself. So I'm waiting for that to arrive and then I'm gonna hook up the other one and then I'll have 21 tracks, which is awesome. I've got another one of those. So I'll hook them all up together. And I've put it through this mixing desk. Mix down classic, which was a bargain. I got my brother-in-law to pick it up and I got it for like 300 quid or something. There's two broken tracks on it, which I'm guessing is fixable, but I'll get someone to do that one day. But uh, yeah, I'm using the first 16 tracks of the minute, and then when I get my other tape machine hooked up, I'll get this one done. I'll plug them all in there. Though it's already plugged in, but I haven't sorted it down there. Uh, it's currently running through my computer monitors. It's not actually playing on the computer. It's playing from the tape, which is awesome. The quality isn't that bad. <laughs> Everyone's like, uh, oh, it's in quarter inch track, so it's gonna sound shit. I mean. I think I've got the left track doesn't have as much highs. That's the right track. So I think I'd need to get that looked at because the left track doesn't have as much top end and it sounds a bit dull compared to the other one. But it works! Which is cool. And this has stayed in sync. It's still locked. Still not figured out how to use this desk yet. There's all sorts of random stuff that I'm just going, oh, I didn't know it did that. So yeah, this isn't like, this was mixed on digital and I've recorded it all to tape on those tracks. And then uh, I've put it back through the desk just to have a play around. And it's fun, it's good fun. Anyway, that's my update. I'll do another update when I get all three working. It'll be so silly. Three R, three R eights all working together. Lol. <laughs> 